Uh, all right, on, on the Tuesday show, I think we may have found a new favorite commentator, at least one of my new favorite commentators, Matt Williamson. He's mm -hmm. a former scout with the Cleveland Browns, works for ESPN and Scout Inc., and it's a great interview, I thought, on the podcast. Yeah. I do say so myself and pat us on the back, but he really had a lot to do with he it. He carried us. He did, he did. And, and, and it was really interesting getting his take on, on a lot of things, and, and in particular on a guy that we think is going to be a big impact guy, probably the last big impact guy the Seahawks add as of the time we're doing this video. It's not technically done yet, though everyone expects Antoine Winfield to be a Seattle Seahawk. And uh, wow, it was exciting to hear one of these guys, a scout like this, be as high on him as he was. Well, he said Seattle had the best secondary in football before the addition of Winfield, and then when it becomes official. Uh, he said he is the best cover corner of a slot receiver in the league, and he pointed to his physicality. He talks about a guy who's kind of gone unnoticed. I mean, people know who he is. He's a Pro Bowl player. He's had a good career. He's older, but he said he's coming off a great season, loves his, his physicality, and he says he's even more physical than Browner and Sherman. Now, I haven't watched Winfield enough to really make that assessment, but this is a guy that's watching everybody. I'll take his word for it, and he loves it. He said it's not only were they the best before him, with him, I mean, it's almost unfair, which, you know, we'll see ultimately how that plays out. But to hear that from somebody outside of the market is, mm -hmm. is a pretty cool thing. Well, and it sort of dovetails what we talked about yesterday here. We were talking about Red Bryant and his impact on the Seahawks defense. And, you know, my belief is that they just were a completely different team against the run without him. And here you're adding a guy who, as, as our, our guy told us, uh, is uh, Matt Williamson told us, is physical, is big, and is terrific at stopping the run. And, look, I mean, it, it's the NFL uh, circa 2013. I, I mean, you play a nickel almost all the time, so he's a guy. He's not going to be on the field, you know, one out of every four downs. The guy's going to be on the field a lot, and may ultimately help the Seahawks in a place they're not thinking of, which is that run defense. Well, yeah, he absolutely can can help shore that up. But he, he you know, think about what we looked at last year and complained about. You know, as much as we love True Font. There, there were a lot of moments in games where we were looking going, boy, he got burned. He got used. He, he just wasn't the same guy. Age catches up with everybody, and it may happen with Winfield. He's older as well, but Trufant had back injuries and everything working against him, and we saw kind of the liability factor there yeah. with that. So it's, it was a very crucial position to address, and to address it to the level that they seem to be doing it with Winfield. I mean, I don't know how you're not even more excited you know you throw that into the addition of Percy Harvin and Averill and Bennett and everybody that they brought in I mean this is this is just setting that expectation bar that much higher and, and Williamson for his part said this is the best team in the NFL it's his Super Bowl pick yeah so make sure you listen to the podcast and uh, I love that we're getting all these Vikings too that's, that's not bad anyone else to take 